monitor purchasing activity for enterprise contract fulfillment. So let's go back and see the purchasing activity as to what's happening because we started this entire course started from the perspective of enterprise contract particularly for procurement contracts. So we started looking at the contract lines, the fulfillment. So what we have done so far is the fulfillment and we need to go back and tie up the enterprise contract. So I'm going to go back there. So let's first go to Fusion Cloud. So there I am. First thing I'm going to do is log off from this uh, supplier user. Okay, and then I'm going to log, log back in as a Lisa Jones. But even before that, I think uh, it will be a good idea that we run the track back program to tie back the purchasing documents to enterprise uh, contracts okay so I've just logged in as procurement manager then I'm gonna go into tools and then schedule processes and you see track purchasing activity is a program that we have got to run once again just to tie back everything from purchasing To enterprise contracts so it basically retrieves the number and status of purchasing documents created by integrated per procurement application from the contract fulfillment line so hit the OK button and then hit submit so process 3058531 was submitted hit the OK button and then you refresh it So it is running so it succeeded okay I don't think there will be anything in log and output but at this point I'm gonna simply go back and you see I can look at the contract from this user itself so go to contract management and then contracts and then I'm gonna look at the contract we have been working on And then hit the search button and that was a contract we have been working on so click on the hyperlink and if you go on to fulfillment you will be able to see a little more information as to what is happening you see the agreement is created the agreement related details and uh, then if you go to purchasing activity you will be able to see more details about what's happening from the purchasing activity perspective again all the summary will be shown so the blanket purchase agreement was created for an agreed amount of three hundred thousand dollars but uh, so far fifteen hundred dollar has been released from this if and that was for the quantity of ten that we have used to create a purchase order release from this blanket purchase agreement via the requisition okay you see that's what it is uh, giving us the details and agreement line details okay so that was for the tying back of the contract to fulfillment the other thing you can do is look at uh, from the perspective of the requisitioner and the uh, now before even before we change the responsibility one thing that I missed out I should tell you now so at the moment you see the status agreement created once this process gets complete the fulfillment process for this particular line I 
think it's a good idea that you go and mark this line as complete by going to actions and hit the complete button so by that what will happen is the status will be updated to complete okay now I'm going to come out of this and I'm going to quickly go and view myself as a requisitioner so I'm going to go to purchasing procurement and then purchase requisitions so from the requisitioners view you see it shows us the recent requisitions so that was the recent requisition and purchase order associated so you click on the requisition it's going to show you more details about what's going on so you look at the requisition life cycle here it's going to show you more details of this requisition in terms of uh, purchasing that has happened so far so did you see that uh, a order has been created a purchase order shipment is there and um, associated receipts and then finally the invoice and the status of payment so this is the paid amount and paid amount is zero so everything is uh, shown over here everything is linked right from requisitions to purchase order to advance shipment notice sent by the supplier then to associated receipt and finally payment against the receipt so invoice and the payment of that invoice all right so it's a very much integrated system everything can be audited and everything is linked together mm -hmm.